But if there was one thing you had to pick out as your proudest career achievement, what would it be? Besides the Bernie Mac show? That would that would be it then. Completely. Completely the Bernie Mac show. There were no black family shows when I did that mm -hmm. show. You know, wife and kids hadn't even started yet. We did a single camera show. It was really about an important thing. There were no typical jokes that you would think. I was very, very proud of that, the way we created that. It is my proudest achievement in the business. Um, as I'm thinking, I'm thinking through right now, just to be sure. <laughs> um, and we got rec the recognition for I it, I mean, too. not just the Emmy, the P you got a Peabody, too, right? Peabody, yeah, we got many awards mm -hmm. for that show. Um, and I got fired from it, you know? Yeah. <laughs> but it taught me so much, yeah. you know, that I would rather get fired having done all that than get fired and not having done all that. Right. You know? <laughs> like if I had just uh, capitulated to all of their wishes and got fired anyway, that would have been horrible. Mm -hmm. Consummation devoutly not to be wished. <laughs> to Ms. Other than, and other than the blitzer joke, is any career regrets? <laughs> any career regrets at all? Uh, no, not at all. Not at all. Um, and like I said, that one only because I'm not a mean person and I think I came across <laughs> mean there. Yeah. And I, I hate coming across in a way that just fundamentally isn't true and was not intended. Right. So that's the part that, I have no problem saying that if that's really the intention that I want to come across, you know. But that one I feel missed the mark and I, and I feel like, uh, yeah, that wasn't good, so. Of everything else, anything else, you no. Know, even when I failed or whatever, I don't mind that it failed because at least I tried or whatever.